Nathan, the body of senior airman Sean McCoe is now back home in Maine. He was shot and killed trying to stop a robbery at a North Little Rock gas station last Friday. And today, TCB 11's Erica Ferrando spoke with his father over the phone. Erica. Sean McCoe moved to Arkansas in December and was getting ready to buy a house with his girlfriend of three years, and they just adopted two puppies. But his bright future was taken away last Friday night. Now his father, Sean McCoe Sr., wants to make sure people know Sean, not for how he was killed, but for who he was when he lived. When you see his picture and you see him smiling, that's him. Friday marks one week since senior airman Sean McCoe was murdered trying to stop an armed robbery at a North Little Rock gas station. He didn't do it to be here or nothing. He just did because he didn't want anybody else being hurt. His father, Sean McCoe Sr., wasn't surprised by his son's actions. That's how he was. He just cared about everybody so much. Now, McCoe's body is back home in Maine following a 118-mile police-escorted procession from Boston. People all over the country, just thousands of people coming together. It doesn't get easier, but the overwhelming support from his friends, family, the Air Force gives them comfort. At Sean's mother's last night, there was probably 100 people there, and it's been like that since the day we found out. He, he was loved by a lot of people, and uh, it's a great loss. And his father says he's thankful for the quick work by North Little Rock Police. Four teenagers are being charged with capital murder in his death. 18-year-old Draquan Robinson is accused of firing the fatal shot. He took away a much better man than you are, and, and uh, it's a shame. It really is, and, you know, to be honest, I feel for their family. Um, but they ruined someone's life for probably trying to get $100. They ruined a lot of people's lives. And, uh, it's just a shame. But as they celebrate McCoe's life, Sean McCoe Sr. wants everyone to know this Sean, a happy 23-year-old who made everyone smile, someone who gave his life to protect others. He was all about just making people smile and being happy and enjoying life. And Sean McCoe Sr. says they're still finalizing arrangements for his funeral, but he did tell me it would be sometime next Saturday in Westbrook, Maine.